Welcome to today's video. In this video, I'll be sharing one of the universities in Germany, which does not permit you to go through uni assist. All right, for people that have been trying to apply to German, Germany universities, you know what uni assist is all about. All right, so this university in Germany, it's not one of those universities that you have to use uni assist to make your application. Okay, so the name of the university is University of Constance. All right, so this is the official website. I'll be taking you through how the courses and how to make your application. All right, most of their courses here are taught in English language for people that have been looking for uh, courses in English language. So let's go through uh, this. We'll go to study and we click on before you study to actually navigate those areas where you can find the courses taught in English language all right so you clicked on before you study you read through the information here studying in touch with state of the art welcomes university of constance studying at the university of constance offers you the best prospects for your future it says yeah choose your personal desired course of study from over 100 study programs and apply from may 9th to july 15th 2023 so we're still in the same uh we're still in the application period in the upcoming winter semester. All right, so the winter semester application period is still open for applicants that are interested. When you scroll down, you have all other information there. All right, so, but we're not going to look at all other information. You are going to take your time at your free time to come and read all other things here. All right, so we go and click on this, apply from May 9th, to July 15 to actually check what courses are available. So it brings us to this page and then you take your time, scroll down. This is ready, set, go. Application and enrollment. Keep in mind your application documents must arrive at the university before the application deadline. All right, so if study program has no admission restrictions, you will definitely be admitted. All right, that's if you have all the required documents. If you scroll down, you have here, Application for undergraduate study program, bachelor's and law, application for graduate study program, master's, other applications. All right, here you have second degree or two degree studies. This means that if you have done a bachelor's degree previously, I want to do a second bachelor's degree, then you can click on that part. The other one you have studying with no higher education entrance qualification. Here you have required language skills, here you have admission regulations. Here you have study programs for working professionals. So I go there and click study programs and then see where it takes us to. You have application graduate for study programs. So if you're for undergraduate, you click on the first one. If you're for masters, you click on the second one. So it brings us to this page, application for masters level studies. So you take a scroll down, you have some information there that you can read at your free time. You have admission requirements. You have, if you're coming to Germany for university studies through the German Academic Exchange Service, DAAD. All right, I already made that the scholarship body for German universities and the International Office of the University of Constance have developed several helpful guides for you. So you can read that up at your free time. Here you have admission requirements. All right, in order to begin a master's study program at the University of Constance, you require a first degree from a university or vocational academy, for example, a bachelor's degree. All right, so it says most study programs at the University of Constance are consecutive programs that build on each other. So you can just read up all the information that you have there. Next, we look at application periods. Here you have the application period also differ depending on the study program. It means that the application timeline for all courses are not the same. For some of them, they might be the same. For some of them, they might not be the same. Please check our study programs overview to find out which deadlines apply to you. You can also check out news and all of that thing. All right, so if you scroll down, you have all other information there. How do I apply and all of that? So the first thing before we go to how do I apply, 
It's actually to check out the programs, the study programs under the master. So I come here and I click on study programs. After that, it brings us to this page. Here you have study programs. You have bachelor main subject. You have bachelor minor subject. You have teaching degree program. You have master. You have international. You have vocational. All right. For people that want to go for vocational courses, you have programs from A to Z. You have doctoral research that for people that want to do their PhD and you have a box for discipline. For a degree program, you click on these because there are some courses that you have to do some semesters in Germany and some semesters in other countries. All right. You have here, you have master's program, 34 programs. For bachelor's, you have 27 programs. For international, that's where you have double degree program. You have about 21 of them. So when you scroll down, you see all that information. You also have some that you can navigate by the left-hand side called Master 34. And let's see where it takes us to. This is the page where it brings us to Master. So we can navigate through this field here. We can navigate with and without restriction. We can navigate form of program. Is it Master? Is it Bachelor's? Is it Teaching Program? We are doing Master. And then here you have Winter Semester or Summer Semester. So you can choose the one. It means that this university takes uh, applicants or application in two period, winter semester and summer semester. So if, if you're going for summer semester, you click here. If you're going for winter semester, you click here. So let's click on winter semester. You click on winter semester. You scroll down, I see all the courses that you can have for winter semester. All right, so mind you, some of them are actually, uh, the application period has passed. All right, so for this video is about people that would want to make applications later. All right, but if your application, if you're still within the application period, do well to actually start making your application. Please do not wait for the deadline uh, period. All right, for advanced safety sciences, for medicine and master science, you can apply at any time. Okay, anthropology and sociology, master of arts, this is the date, this is the date. All right, so you can still apply. Okay, if you scroll down, you have biological science, master of science, the application period is still open at this time chemistry master of science you have it here it's still open speech and language processing master of arts is still open sports science is still open all right so if you take your time to scroll down check out your courses here all right if they are still open so we're going to just check out few courses and see if or how to make the application so you can click on advanced safety uh, science for medicine all right you click on there and you have a uh, postgraduate study program requires a first university degree all right look at the information that you have there start clicking on advanced safety for medicine master of science you can just scroll down read up what the course is about so for these people that are, people that are in this faculty or department you can just read through it says their program starts winter semester and summer semester so please take notes Whenever the application has passed, you can just wait for the next timeline. All right, period of study, no standard period of study. Application period, you can apply anytime. Admission restriction, no. ECT is 60. All right, if you scroll down, you have on that information, the Y study, advanced safety med science for medicine, University of Constance. You can read through it there. Look at the content, prospect and opportunities. You can just click on it and read up career prospects there. Program structure. Okay, you can read up that as well. We're not going to take time on that. Internship and study program, all right? You can read up there as well. What are the requirements? What interests and skills should you have? What language skills do you need to bring? You have to document your English language skill. For example, through IELTS, minimum score seven. That is just for this course, all right? Not for all courses. Some courses, the English test skill required is about six for IELTS, all right? Or an equivalent language test. Or you can get your the language mainly used in class is English. That's your um, MOI. Admission requirements, when you click on it, you have all the admission requirements. If you find that application and application document, read through all of these and then you continue. Another course we can look at is multilingualism. All right, on that art, Master of Art. Program starts winter semester and summer semester, period of study, four semesters, application period. It's still open, all right, summer and winter. winter. All right, so if, you're, if you can make it for the summer period, you can make it for the winter period for your application. 
Okay, ECTS is 120, number of students 30. You have prospect and opportunities, programs, um, structure, internship, and study abroad. When you click on it, you have the information that it says here. In the third semester, students can choose between a stay abroad, study multilingualism at one of our partner institutions or undertaking an internship with a company institution research group relevant to the degree. All right, so you read up all the information there. What interests and skills should I have? Language skills. All right, foreign language skills, documentation of advanced English language skills, spoken and written English level B2 of the C common European framework of reference for languages, documentation of advanced French language skills, if this if you're going for the double degree program. All right. And then you have the information. It says the language of instruction will be mainly English. All right. But upon availability, there might be also some courses taught in German other than modern language. So in multilingualism, I understand that some courses are English, English, some courses are English, French, some courses are English, German. So it depends on the one that you choose to apply for admission requirements. You have all the admission requirements here. When you click on fees, you have all the information that you need there. All students enrolled at the University of Constance are charged a semester fee, like I said earlier. When you click here, you find all other information that you will require to make your application, application documents and all of that. You click on it and you find all other information. So after checking all your courses, you can just come back to the main page and then you have this application process here. Before you apply, all right, you read through what you need to know. They are step by step. After checking, you need to check your course first, check your admission requirements, and then you read through all that you need to have before starting to make your application. All right. You have the information for the application period here as well, like we have seen previously. Okay. So the application, how do I apply? It says complete the online application and upload the required application documents to the ZEUS. All right, on the pages of the University of Constance study program, you also find information on which documents you have to upload as part of the online application. That was the previous page I took you through. All right, so you, say, so you need to apply online. Do I have to submit separate application for some study programs? If you're interested in applying for any child to study program, please submit your application with this link here. For Master of Advanced Safety Science for Working Professionals, all right, you use this page here. How many study programs may I apply for? You can apply for admission to two study programs. If you are accepted by both study programs, then you need to select one of the two. After applying what you need to do, you receive a confirmation in your email once your online application has been submitted. The University of Constance will inform you via email where application status changes. Additionally, you can visit my studies section to the ZEUS application portal to check your application status. When will I be admitted to University of Constance? You read up the information there. And for people that want to start their, making their application, you can just click on click on apply online and it takes you to a page. After clicking to go to Zeus, it brings you to this page. Mind you, when it brings you to this page, it might give you in, in, in German language, you come up here and change it to English and then it, it transforms the page to three. Okay, so here you have home application, current students, lecturers, doctoral, researchers, alumni, employers, international, FAQs, courses, and the others that you can find. And here you have applicants, current students, international visit applicants. You have decided on a study program and are ready to apply. So you can click on that and find out where it takes you to. All right, so after clicking on that, we're going to click on master's program, and this is where it brings you to. Online application for a degree program. It says here, dear university applicants, thank you very much for your interest in studying at the University of Constance. Submitting your application is the most important step towards obtaining your study program placements. Please follow the simple step. The first one is for you to register, register for access to the University of Constance application portal. All right. The next is run through the online application process. Your school living certificate, your academic degree, additional documents, if necessary. All right, scroll down and look at all of that information that you have there. In addition to this, you need a PDF program and then you have all other information. You just know that the first thing is for you to register on the Zeus platform. Scroll down and read all of that information that you need there. So you click your application portal, I click on it and it takes you to a page. After clicking that, you have this page here. 
All right, it says need fill or required fields. After the registration, we will send you an email describing the next steps. It also contains your user data used for logging after work. Here you have, don't bother about those first two. All right, because you got get that later. Okay, so for freshers, you need to enter your personal data, your surname, your first name, your first name, gender, you click on it and you impute name of prefix. That is not important, date of birth, place of birth, country of birth, your phone number, mobile phone number, email, repeat your email again and you choose a password that you need to always use to log in. All right, it says your password must leave, must have at least six characters. One of them must be a special character. Those are the examples here. You're fixing your password, retype it again, and then scroll down. You see all that information that you have, the security question, get any of the questions, put the response, data privacy, you need to tick this, all right, when you're done typing in. Once you type, click on that, it shows you register. You click on register, and then it sends you a direct, um, uh, login details in your email, uh, in your inbox, in your email. All right. So that's that about University of Constance. So if you find this video very useful, please hit the uh, like button, share this video with family and friends. Click on the like button because that's the only way YouTube will, you will help YouTube to recommend this video to a lot of people wanting to migrate to Germany to study and share this video with a lot of people who are also interested in, in studying in Germany in English language, subscribe if you're new here. I really appreciate Please follow the step-by-step. -step. Remember that to apply to this University of Constance, most of the courses have two timeline application. You have winter, you have a uh, summer period, all right? And if this is not for you, you can share with family and friends. Thank you for watching this video and do turn on your post notification to get updated and be the first person to know when I upload new videos, useful ones, as this that you are watching. Thanks for watching and see you in my next video.